Assalamu alaikum everyone. Hope you all are fine and starting well. So we have started our year final term and you know that we have something new topic in our syllabus and according to your syllabus we are here to learn something new that is conjunction. A very new topic for you all. So you will find it in your grammar workbook unit 24 page 88. So what is conjunction? Conjunction means some words that will connect two statements or two sentences. That means when two sentences or two statements uh, express same idea or opposite idea, according to that meaning, we will use an or but to relate that sentences. So what does our book say? The conjunctions and and but can be used to join two statements. And shows addition and is used when the statements are similar. But is used to connect statements that express opposite ideas. At first, we have to understand the meaning, we have to catch the meaning, what does the statement say. So, at first, we will go, for example, using and, like, mango is a juicy fruit, it contains... Vitamins too. Sorry, it does not know here. It contains vitamins. Every fruit contains vitamins, right? Mango is a juicy fruit, it contains vitamins. That means mango is a juicy fruit and it contains vitamins because those are positive qualities. They are saying about the mango, right? Mango is a juicy fruit, it contains vitamins. Or you can say mango is a juicy fruit, I like it. If I write here, I like it, then it will also be same. I like it. That means as mango is a juicy fruit, you like it. Mango is a juicy fruit, tasty fruit, sweet fruit, that's why you like it. So mango is a juicy fruit and I like it. So, here I will use the conjunction and. I hope it's clear. Another thing I can say. Uh, today is Friday. We will go outside. Today is Friday, we will go outside. As Friday is a holiday or off day or weekend, we will go outside. That means it's similar. <clears throat> it expresses the similar meaning and it relates to statements. Today is Friday and we will go outside. That means as it is off day, weekend, so we will go outside. The conjunction is and. So many examples can be like this. Like in your book there are another example that is my mother is a teacher my mother is a teacher she loves the students so as your mother is a teacher she is connected with the students and definitely she loves the students. That means two sentences express similar meaning. My mother is a teacher and she loves the students. <clears throat> okay. So when you find that two statements, two sentences almost similar and expressing similar ideas, they are connecting each other with same meaning, similar meaning, similar ideas, we will use the conjunction and. <clears throat> now we will show, we will work something where we will use the conjunction but. Like, I wanted a cup of tea. Mother gave me a glass of milk. Is the thing here. Thing is, 
you wanted something and your mother gave you something else i wanted a cup of tea but mother gave me a glass of milk so are they similar no because you wanted tea but you got milk both are uh, useful for you both are uh, good for your health but they are not same when you will uh, like coffee but somebody offers you tea so these are not similar so what will you use there we will use the conjunction but i wanted a cup of tea but mother gave me a glass of milk when we will use conjunction then the next uh, sentence the next letter will be with <coughs> small letter okay another example using but the tv is on nobody is watching now what's happening here the general thing is when tv is on that means somebody is watching right or we uh, on tv that's why we can watch or to watch tv watch uh, cartoon it may be news it may be discovery channels many things else so when the tv is on it's general that somebody is watching or to watch we generally switch on the tv but here the tv is on nobody is watching now that means the tv is on but there is nobody in this room to watch it so the tv is on but but nobody is watching now that means maybe at this moment there is some emergency they left the room but actually somewhere watching but at this moment the tv is on but nobody is watching so when two sentences two uh, things are different are opposite when there is no similarity we will use but as conjunction okay so there are uh, <clears throat> in short the use of and and but to connect to sentences or statements and there are so much uh, exercises examples in your book using and or but when we will do it in our zoom class we will definitely solve the exercises in our copy inshallah and this and but use the use of and or but as conjunction in sentences that's a short idea for your better understanding inshallah we will meet in our zoom class with a broad idea Till then, take care, study, and be careful about your health. Thank you. Allah Hafiz.